In this presentation, we will review real-time process monitoring in Enterprise IQ. Enterprise IQ provides real-time access to your industrial automation performance and process data using real-time manufacturing process monitoring software. This provides full interoperability and integration to your factory floor industrial automation field device components such as PLCs, controllers, instruments, and intelligent control systems through a myriad of devices, networks, protocols, and formats. Real-time process monitoring provides four connectivity methods to your factory floor. The first being OPC. Real-time process monitoring can connect and integrate with OPC client server compliant systems. OPC is a client server technology and a leading widely accepted industrial communication standard. OPC enables the exchange of data between OPC compliant industrial field devices and applications. The OPC server is a software program that converts the hardware communication protocol used by a PLC into the OPC protocol. Most new industrial systems are OPC client server compliant. Legacy PLC and field components can be made to be OPC compliant when bridged and connected using their legacy drivers and protocols to an OPC server. The OPC server is then a conduit that can communicate data continuously among PLCs on the shop floor and real-time process monitoring. A leading OPC server is Kept Server X, which IQMS has selected and fully supports. Kept Server X leverages OPC and IT-centric communication protocols such as SNMP, ODBC, and web services, and offers the broadest range of drivers available, supporting devices across various verticals with any industrial automation industry, and supports a variety of wired and wireless network mediums for Ethernet, serial, and proprietary networks. Kept Server X supports the OPC Unified Architecture, OPC UA, Specification, and many of the OPC Classic specifications, including OPC Data Access, OPC DA. The second connection method is a direct connection. IQMS has developed many proprietary device drivers that can create direct, tightly coupled connections from real-time process monitoring to factory floor systems, field devices, and components using a variety of communication protocols, proprietary drivers, and data access methods. The third method is using the IQMS PLC, the PMIU88. Many older or closed proprietary industrial systems do not have or expose PLCs for external access. For this, IQMS has designed and developed its own PLC to connect to such systems. This gives users a solution to connect to any equipment, including even chiller towers, dryers, mixers, blenders, and ovens, new or old, via sensors and machine IOs. The fourth method is using a file system. Many industrial systems export process data to files. In these scenarios, IQMS can import the mapped file content into real-time process monitoring on a time interval or after file directory activity. Here is a visual mapping of the data collection process. Now, let's take a look at how real-time process monitoring looks in Enterprise IQ. This screen is a real-time chart screen. It's here where users can see the data that is being captured in real-time and all of the parameters that are being measured. Each machine and job can have their own unique set of parameters that are being measured. This particular machine and job is capturing five data points, maximum fill pressure, cycle counts, barrel temperatures, pack times, and cycle times. Users can also do correlation analysis between any of the parameters that are being measured. In this example, by a simple drag and drop of one chart to another, users can see how the barrel temperature might affect the maximum fill pressure and maybe how both affect the pack time. They can combine two or more of these parameters by simply dragging and dropping one chart over another. As I mentioned, each machine has their own unique set of parameters being measured for each particular job. It's here where users can set up what is going to be monitored for that particular machine and job, and also where they can set the upper and lower target limits for each one of those parameters. As the upper and lower targets are set, the system will then generate alarms when any one of the parameters are outside of these thresholds. To get a closer look at the alarms, users can simply select the Alarms tab, and you can see the alarms that have been triggered for this machine and job. Users can also set up a visual plant floor layout. 
where they can see all their machines and their physical location on the floor and which ones are triggering alarms. With just one click, users can view the alarms happening at a particular machine. They do not have to interact with the system to be notified of an alarm. The alarm system can send text messages, emails, or even be hooked into the PA system on the shop floor to notify the quality department or the supervisors of which machine is having an issue. All of this data is kept in its own unique database and can be updated into the ERP system in real time. It can be updated at any specified time interval, or it can be manually imported in as desired. This data can be accessed at any time through the Historian tab if users are simply looking for particular data points, or, more importantly, it can be accessed through IQMS's proprietary statistical process control module. From here, users can come in and select any given item, and users can generate my XBAR and R charts and histograms using IQMS's chart wizard. From here, users can select the parameters that they want to plot. They can add additional filtering criteria for production dates, work order numbers, lot numbers, all the way down to the tooling used on that job. Once they've identified the desired parameters with the filtering criteria, users can apply and populate all of the process monitoring data that relates to that filtering criteria. They can select all, or users can individually select or deselect particular samples. From here, users can plot all of this data for the X-bar and R charts. If any parameters fall outside of the CPJ requirement set, users get notified of that. From here, to generate a professional-looking document, there is a simple Microsoft Word export in which users can quickly generate a Word document with the full statistical analysis of any historical process monitoring data, again with the same X-bar, R charts, histograms, and full statistical analysis with just a couple of clicks. Thank you for taking the time to watch this overview of IQMS Real-Time Process Monitoring. If you would like more information on the products and services from IQMS, please visit IQMS.com.